I am scared. I am very worried about what is going to happen in ranked seasons maybe for the rest of the season. Dude. This was an amazing update. This update was one of the best of the year, maybe. At least in my opinion, there was so many good things released in terms of players. If we're just simply talking about the new Team Affinity 3, I'm kind of worried, actually, because there's so many good cards to get. You know I was excited for maybe only one person. They were no way in hell going to give Vlad a Team Affinity. That's just the unfortunate truth. They are most likely going to try and wait until the end of the year or something. I have absolutely no idea what the plan was, but it was like a 99% chance they were going to give Hernandez one. Why did they not give him really good power versus righties? I don't understand. Like the last couple of good Teoscar cards, he hasn't had good power versus righties. I don't know. I'm just... I'm just, I don't know. I'm salty that they didn't give him amazing power versus righties, but if you face a lefty, there's probably no chance that pitcher is making out of that at bat alive. They actually gave him good speed on this card too. Surprised his arm strength isn't as high as it should be, but that's fine. Cedric Mullins got a really good card in my opinion. Offensively, yes. Defensively, that can be a little bit of a problem, especially with that arm strength. He might have to play left. At least he has good speed to make up for. But this is not going to be one of those players who is just absolutely pathetic against lefties or something. Jose Ramirez got one. I am always a big fan when Jose Ramirez gets a car. This is one of those weird ones a little bit. Has, you know, average... Uh, average contact and then insane power. Parallel 5 might work a lot with these, but this one, for sure. This is just... I mean, this is all right. Against lefties, this is going to be amazing. The only reason I'm using them is because I did amazing with Albies last year. Now, this is probably... This is this season's going to be very scary. I don't know if there's ever going to be a scary... Or what? I'm so terrified I can't even put together a sentence to explain what the hell they just did. I am fucking petrified. I have never in my life been more scared of anything. So we are at the point now where if we don't face Cabrera, it is most likely going to be 99 de Grom in July. It's not even October or some shit. It is July still. This is absolutely insane. There is nothing bad on this. Nothing. If you do parallel five this son of a bitch, he will almost have max hits per nine. For a starter, I have no idea what ranked even is anymore. All right, so this is a new season, so if ranked already wasn't the most terrifying thing for me personally the last week, then this is probably the definition of it. I know I'm gonna face DeGrom. I'm not even going into this thinking otherwise. I know for a fact I'll be facing DeGrom right now. So... What a way to start the season. Not to mention there's going to be probably another 125 lefty righty. Oh shit, thank God. This guy does not have Cabrera or DeGrom. I love this guy. I'm sitting there saying shit about people, but I'm using DeGrom. This cannot be bad now because this honestly could have been one of the worst nights of the year. And now this shouldn't be. He's probably running as fast as he humanly can up to his bedroom. We grab a new pair of underwear. He just saw 99 DeGrom on the mound. He shat himself. Well, hopefully this does go well. He was just early on a fastball. Is that a sign? That's gonna be a single. Oh, he does not if DeGrom has anything to say about it. They changed the urgency for the pitchers? Wait a minute, yeah, that's... The fuck we even appealing? Come on, man. Time to play well. Time to play well in something other than an event. No, that's fine. That's fine. Just don't be late. That's what you have to do. As long as I'm not late or early, I don't even give a shit if I'm on anything. Does that make sense? Vlad. Listen, if that was actually real life, Vlad, his ass would have ran that out. This guy is asking for problems putting Nelson Cruz in the outfield. Hit everything to right. Or do you have him in left? Oh, oh God. He was on it. Up. Upstairs, up. Jesus, he was early on that. 
Okay, what the fuck did I press? I was running to the dugout. I don't want to wait till the damn fifth inning to do something here. Can I fucking wake the hell up here? That's a nice take that I probably would have took even if it was in the zone. Hernandez is going deep. I was not early on that. He's going 450 to center. No, I'm... Don't do it. Fucking asshole. Run it out at least. Be a hero. I am salty. Don't tell me that was boxing who made that graph. I cannot fucking stand it anymore. Holy shit. Dude, are you fucking shitting me? Strike this fucking idiot out. Sick. Sick of it. Holy fuck. It is never good when your opponent or anybody doesn't have a hit and then the pitcher steps up. That is the last situation you ever want to be in. Oh yeah. They're looking to row something. That was so close to being fucking shit on. Oh my god. Whoa, they really changed Ozzy's stance since last year. He's barely on the screen right now. Dude, ranked is fucked this year. Ranked is very, very hard. I have never felt such hopelessness. Oh my fuck. Well, you know you have somebody good on the mound when you're throwing that and they're late on it. This guy must not know that was fixed. Now a slider, but this misses down and in for ball four. Shut the fuck up. Take a seat, man. What's he even waiting for at this point? This is gonna have to be a game where I pitch. Because I already haven't shown up offensively again. I haven't shown up offensively and ranked in a week, and that is clearly going to continue this evening. Holy shit, I thought that was getting by. Jesus, look at that. It's a fucking donut on the board everywhere. Good fucking shit. This is it. Right here. I'm not fucking waiting around anymore. This is pathetic. That's the first fucking hit of the game. Flat. That is absolutely crushed! Wake the fuck up! So I'm confused here. What is... Uh, I guess... Oh my fuck, no. God, no. The live series DeGrom already has the parallel system, plus inside edge. I should have looked at that. So if you have DeGrom parallel 5, and you have his inside edge on top of it, what the fuck are his per nines then? That hit him in the foot. Interesting move. It's always interesting when they take a lefty out and put another lefty in. Get up and throw it! He was running into center! Buddy, I'm not missing that anymore. This may be ugly, but I'm starting to heat up a little bit. And by heat up, I mean just putting the ball in play. That's better than what it was the first four innings, though. I am fucking bad with Trout, apparently, all over again. I was amazing with Trout, now I can't buy a hit. Wow. Jesus, this is already a game I need to win because I'm getting the luck. I already got a shitty hit. I got the fucking error at short. This is a game I simply cannot lose now. Jesus Christ. Dude, does he not know that every time you put the ball in play with this guy, it's a home run? I can't even imagine how fast that is when you're actually batting. Why was that in the zone? That could have been very, very bad. Putting a righty in is kind of interesting, but... DeGrom is doing everything. He wasn't even looking. I don't trust it. This guy, with the speed up, you know he's going to lay one down at some point. Who's getting it? Dude, like that is, Trout is right there. How many fucking ugly ones have I played? I cannot count. To do 
Oh, boom. This is exactly what this is going to become. I have way better bats versus lefties. Why not take some pitches here for the love of fuck? Work a count. I'm fucking going up here hacking. I, I did not barely press the button. Should I not be a bitch and steal? I might steal. I might go. Should I do it? I'm such a bitch. I could steal so many bags, but I just refuse to. Buddy, that is not working anymore, dude. This guy's nightmare has come to life. That does not work anymore. Jesus, if he actually laid one down, he would have made it. Fuck, now I need to pay attention who has the shift on. Well, I think it's safe to say that Nelson Cruz is not bunting. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if he did bunt with Nelson Cruz. I've never seen better bunts get down in this game. Look, he could lay one down right to the second baseman where he's supposed to be. This is already the seventh inning. To Oscar! Thank fucking Christ I'm actually pitching here. See, this is a game last year, if this was me playing it, I would be losing 10 nothing by now because I would be shitting the bed in both categories. I would be doing pathetic at the plate and pathetic on the mound. Luckily, I'm doing pathetic at the plate and not pathetic on the mound. Get him again. He's dealing on the hill for shit's sakes. Breaking motherfuckers' backs! Uh-oh. Run to it, don't jog! I don't know why I play here. Well, you know when they swing like that, nothing's happening. All right, come on, let's let's go to the ninth here. Nothing's being done. Jesus, fuck if I've ever seen an ugly game. This is it. No. Okay, that's better actually. And look at this, a bunt attempt to start the ninth. And he'll reach first as they can't make the play on him. Take him! He's out! But this is speared by the first baseman. He just slid through Vlad. Good night.